What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another Highly Combustible Reaction. We're going to be jumping into the next one on our Simba journey. The young boy just put out his newest one, Hold Me Studio Sessions. We're excited for it. Uh, I've been told it might be a little bit different than the Simba that we're used to. He's looking already a little bit different than the Simba that we're used to, aside from the blunt in his hand. But let's jump right in. Let's see what he's bringing us with this studio performance. The last one was fire, so let's check it out. Hey guys, what's up? What's up? Welcome to uh, Simba Studio Sessions. This is basically Plush Studios. Uh, me and Plush go pretty far back. I've been recording here for quite a minute. Uh, up until recently, actually. So, me and Plush, I guess I came here, I recorded uh, Cage, Bitter, and I believe it was heroin all in one session. Um, and I, I, like, I think I did heroin and then, well, I, did, I shouldn't say I did heroin. Um, sorry. Yeah, you shouldn't song, say I, that. I created the song heroin. You definitely shouldn't say I did heroin at Plus Studios. No, negative, Simba. That's bad publicity. I shouldn't say I did heroin. Um, sorry. I did the song, I, I've created the song heroin. That's much okay? better. I, I sang it. And then I did a part of Cage, and I think can we I did get the this? Thing can we get the boy an ashtray so he's not ashing in his hand? Well, I guess one of the co-owners or the owner was like out here whenever I was recording, and he basically gave me free studio time. So that's why I started recording here. And so thanks to these guys, honestly, um, a lot of my stuff got recorded and really fine equipment. <laughs> so. Uh, I just want to give a shout out to Plush, for real, uh, for seriously making this kind of happen in, in, in a way. Um, but, yeah, uh, anyway, uh, that was kind of like the start of my everything. But, I mean, you're not really here for this, so... No shit. Cue the music. Stop running, you suck. Is it... I'm just fucking with him. I love the boy. Let's go. Is he gonna cue? Wait, is he gonna... And everything goes, and everything goes, and everything goes black for a minute. What's up, it's feeling wrong. Open my eyes, we got to kiss it. I'm trying to move on. Yeah, yeah. Trying to move on. You said you're never coming back, but you did it. Now you think we can't pick up what we left off. Just wait until I count them stacks, count them millions, all our problems disappear, yeah, they dissolve. Come on, boy. Oh, you said that you would stay, and so I put you in your place, you belong. You said that you would stay. Uh, this is so different, Simba. These notes and stuff that he's hitting. Now I know why he's been screwing up his voice. Because he's got to get that grit in there, and he's got to get it sounding just right. He's obviously been practicing with some different, like, you you guys know, we just had our Simba interview. If you haven't checked that out, go check it out. It's like a three-hour long deep dive into the artist that is Simba and his first uh, Poetic Origins album. This Hold Me is going to be, uh, as far as I know, the start of the next album, and, uh, so far, it's pretty fire. Like, we haven't seen any rapping yet from Simba. This is just straight up him and his talented-ass vocals and that sharp-ass jaw. Look look at that jawline. Come on, let's go. Oh, you said that you would stay. And so I put you in your place. You yes. Belong. You said that you would stay. And so I put you in your place where you belong. Some soul in there now. Come on. Everything goes and everything goes. Everything goes, yeah. everything goes, and everything goes, and everything goes. I'm night. I was my eyes, I can hear no street in my eye. Yeah, yeah. Why would she lie? Fuck it, she lies. I'm cutting ties. So suicide, so 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 so suicide, yeah, yeah. 
Yeah. If I am lying, why would you cry? Just cry me a river and cut me a line. Yeah. Well, don't waste my time. Well, don't look behind. Well, don't look behind. Well, don't you look bad? Just holding my bed at you, Steph. I fought for you. The war is over. And now I feel like a fool. First is drug abuse, then I'll be sober. Okay, well, maybe a few. And if I'm not fucked up, I'm hungover. But don't get confused, cause I'm pulling through. Oh, don't get confused. Cause we got me coughing, nicotine is locked in. Swear to God, that shit gon' put me in a fucking coffin. Ask how long I've had these thoughts, I just reply we often. Yeah. That wordplay, come on, Simba, this ain't rapping. This is, oh, this is something else. This is something else entirely. You done stepped it up a notch. Wow, wow, wow. Not gonna lie, I don't wanna be the girl that he's singing about. In his locked in, swear to Listen God, to that it. shit gon' put me in a fucking coffin. Ask how long I've had these thoughts, I just reply we often. Yeah. Just waiting for the day that I can off it. Pull it in my brain, I swear to God, it's like I lost it, like my heart did. I ain't it all day, just smoking, drink, I'm feeling nauseous. See it through the SNBA optics, this is pop says. Ooh. Simba, Simba, Simba That I can already tell That the next album Past Poetic Origins Is going to be Simba Showing what Simba can do Poetic Origins was more of a Hey, introduction, here I am This is me, this is why I'm here This is where I'm coming from This is whew. I think we'll see a little bit of that in this but I think we're also going to see a little bit more of his current life, a little bit more of his, maybe him talking some shit. You know what I mean? Like, come on, Simba. This one was different. He left out the rapping like we discussed in his interview. He, can't, he don't have a genre. He don't want to be bound by genre borders. He don't want to be stuck in a box. Mad respect for that. Like, seriously, don't ever let somebody, don't ever let somebody confine you to one certain thing if you've got an art and your art can go in many different ways let it go in as many ways as possible you never know who you're gonna pick up you never know who you're gonna find along the way i'm excited for this new album i'm excited for more simba sessions in the studio there's some new stuff coming up i'm hearing through the download with uh lucas delgra that they're talking about doing some fire things together so lots of things in the future coming up if you haven't already shown Simba that love, go hit him up. His stuff's down there in the description. Go show him some love. Go show Lucas some love. They're all part of the Coalition Entertainment Group, who's currently bringing on more artists as well. They got their eyes on some people. So they're going to be growing here really soon. There's going to be something to keep your eyes on as they progress through this journey that they're on right now and that's what it is it's a journey simba's had a hell of a journey so far and it's even though it's been a short one it's been a wild one uh I'm, i appreciate you guys being here if you guys enjoyed the content hit the like button if you dislike it hit the dislike button check out one of my other videos that's floating around up here subscribe if you want to see more content possibly your content go show simba and lucas some love down there in the description and uh join this family it's the greatest family on youtube that like i said the subscribe button's right here just smash it until the next one, I'm highly combustible. I'm out of here. Love y'all to the moon and back. Peace.